Welcome back. Ever since we've been in Oman, people have been talking about things that distinguish Oman from other countries. And one thing that keeps coming up is perfume. With me now is David Crickmore. He's the CEO of Armoage. This is a perfume that is inspired by frankincense, isn't it? Absolutely, yes. We, we founded this brand many years ago, and uh, it was all set up to express the heritage of frankincense growing in this country. How long does that whole process take? The process of creating a fragrance right from the inspirational stage oh, all yeah. the way through takes around a year to get to the shop, to get to the shelves. We're positioned as a niche brand. We are a brand that is for a specific consumer that has a very sophisticated approach to wearing perfume. It's sold to the very discerning, appreciative uh, market out there who have a lot of money to spend. How much does a bottle of the good stuff cost? Well, it varies, uh, but the, the average cost in the States would be around $250. What we've tried to do now is to contemporize that and, and do a more international Arabic flavor to the overall look of the brand. The key thing that we do here is we take all the wonderful, wonderful, rich ingredients from around this part of the world, the myrrh, the frankincense, the oud, the so on and so forth, and we team it with wonderful ingredients from the European world as well, such as the rose, such as lavender, such as all of those lovely ingredients too. And if you were to tell someone who knows nothing about armoire, has never even heard about it until now, how, how would you describe it to them? What would you say? I would say it's a fragrance that doesn't follow the pack. It is not like all the other fragrances that are out there today that smell pretty much the same. It is a fragrance that is sophisticated, but above all, it's a fragrance that has its own voice and has a song. If you have ever wanted to walk 